trading the out for the season with an ACL injury in 2025 unrestricted free agent DeAnthony Melton, plus three second round picks for Dennis Schroeder, GM for the Warriors Mike Dunleavy stole what he needed from the Brooklyn Nets. The 12-year NBA veteran and German national team legend was averaging a career-high 6.6 .6 assists per game and shooting a career-best 88.9% from the free-throw line for the Nets through 23 games in 24-25. The Warriors didn't have to give up either Brandon Pajemski or Jonathan Kaminga, potentially leaving them assets to continue making trades, and with Dennis, they get a point guard capable of either manning two guard lineups next to Stephen Curry or carrying the bench unit, given he started every game he played in for a team with a play-in tournament spot in Brooklyn. To get a quick idea for the type of player Golden State's acquiring, Dennis ranks first in the association in 10 assist, zero turnover games, making him a good fit with a Golden State team that ranks 15th in fewest turnovers per night. Additionally, across the NBA, only 7 players are averaging 18 plus points, 5 plus assists, while shooting at least 45% from the field, 35% from 3 point range, and 85% from the foul line. Dennis Schroeder is one of them, and he's next to some elite company. The only players averaging that aside from Dennis are 8 time All Star Kyrie Irving, 8 time All Star Damian Lillard, 2022 All-Star Darius Garland, 2020 All-Star Brandon Ingram, 2022 Sixth Man of the Year Tyler Hero, and 10-time All-Star, 2-time MVP, 2-time Scoring Champion, and 4-time NBA Champion Stephen Curry. At the top of his game, just two outings prior to his trade to the Warriors, Dennis posted a season-high 34 points to go along with 11 assists, and fittingly, based off him leading the NBA in 10 assists, 0 turnover games, in that 34-point showing against the Milwaukee Bucks, Dennis had 0 TOs. Speaking of TO, Schroeder signed a 2-year $26 million deal for my hometown Toronto Raptors last year before being traded mid-season. He never found his stride with the ultimately rebuilding Raptors, I don't think he bought in fully, but when he plays in a situation where he's passionately committed, like when he wore his heart on his sleeve for the German national team at the 2023 FIBA World Cup, that's when Dennis can be special. In that tournament, he won FIBA World Cup MVP and led his national team to their first World Cup title. Nevertheless, for a Warrior team that ranks in the bottom 5 in the league in points per game since November 18th, the scoring punch that Dennis will provide will be essential. Fantastic trade by the Warriors front office, as we'll see what Schroeder has in store for the dubs. This was your boy D-Flow, and I'll see you next video.